nothing to really take um, take us through. Um, needed to stop. You know, tough shot both ways. Two physical teams. Um, that's pretty much it. How did that play come together for your shot at the end of overtime? There looked a little different from some of the you know last second plays you've run for a lot this year. Yeah, that, that was you know just random. The play broke down. Um, we ran an action, but Atlanta kind of blew it up. Um, so I just made a play um, towards the ball. KP found me, and then I got off a, a tough shot, but it went in. What was supposed to play happen on that play originally? Uh, supposed to be like a rip screen, trying to see if we can get a layup um, towards the rim. But Atlanta's physicality, you know, kind of blew it up, so we weren't able. To KP caught it way further than he would have liked. Um, so I just ran and tried to make a play on the ball. Jalen, what have you guys learned over the past two games? Like, what has this taught you, this trip here? I think it's, I think it's been good. I think, uh, one, give credit for Atlanta, but this is like a playoff level of physicality. I think they benefited from the whistle. We would have liked to see some more consistency from it, but, you know, some days it's going to be like that, especially on the road in the playoffs. You know, I felt like I got fouled, especially like going towards in the fourth quarter. On uh, and uh, before overtime, that go ahead bucket, they let that go. But you know, you know, some days it's gonna be consistent, some days it's not. Still got to find ways to win and uh, and match the level of physicality. I think we did good for the most part outside of the the, the glass. Like uh, we had to get on the glass, uh, fight on the glass. Um, I got to do a better job of getting there, and getting those rebounds. Um, but give credit to Atlanta, they they tough, you know. Um, and when you get a whistle that swings your way, it makes you even tougher. So. Um, Definitely some good information that we can learn from. Murray missed a ton of shots. He also made a ton of shots, but they got a ton of second chance points off those misses. That was it. Yeah. Murray, tough player. You know, um, a lot of respect. You know, he played played his ass off, allowed his team to get the win. Um, but I felt like we guarded him pretty well. He made some tough ones. Um, but we just got to get on the glass. That was that was the key to the game. Offensive glass. Capella, you know, was a, a beast down there. But um, we got to be. We got to up our level of physicality on the glass. We didn't do that. And that's why we that's why we lost. They've been trying to kind of relearn who they are with Trey out, and it seems like this week especially they've really started to figure it out. And now you you actually might see them in the first round again. So like, how are they starting to transform, and what kind of tests are they bringing? For you? Yeah, I mean, the season is a bunch of it's a journey, it's ups and downs. Um, so they're trying to figure out their identity, trying to figure out the way they want to play, and, and stuff like that. And um, you know. Uh, I guess that's, uh, we'll wait and see if we match up with them in the playoffs, but uh, we'll be ready. Just like you said, it's a learning experience, having that top five back together and in those situations, how important can that be? Can what be? Beneficial having those top five, you guys there on the floor, clutch situations. Yeah, in the fourth quarter, we got a bunch of great looks. I think we had like, at one point, D. White missed a floater. KP kind of missed a layup at the rim and then Drew missed a, a left hand layup. All like back to back sequences was wide open looks um, in the fourth quarter. And I thought those was you know great looks that just, they just didn't go down. Um, and that kind of led to them, you know, um, feeling more comfortable, more confident. Um, but, you know, I feel like we executed. I think we just got to be more physical um, and, and own our space a little bit more. But it's good, it's good information to, to learn from. Joe said a lot, a lot of those one-point games, final minute, just come down the shot making. You guys are four and eight in those spots this year. Is there anything else you can point to in those spots that you guys need to improve on before the playoffs? Those one-point games, final minute. Uh, I think just you know, like you said, execution, um, not settling. Sometimes I think we um, have settled um, or whatever, um, and we can get to the basket and and things like that. But you know, I think. Uh, I think we'll be ready when it's when it's time to come. We just got to make sure that we execute. We got our space in, and then uh, we're not settling because you know we're not leaving it to the officiating. You know, you get to your spot, go up and down, and, and live with those results. Presented by your New England Ford dealers, built for America, built Ford proud.